This video will show you how to create a free landing page which will collect emails with systemy.io. So the first step, just Google for systemy. It's gonna be the first result, this one. From here, you can just create yourself a squeeze page, thank you page, and make email campaigns. This can all be done for free, as you can see here, no credit card required. So what do you have to do? Click on get my free account or just here with your email, enter in your email, confirm that. And if you were following along and you've signed up for an account on systemy.io, you should be taken to the dashboard. Now what we can do is we can start to build our landing page. Now to do this, you wanna go here to funnels, right here, funnels. And you can see I already got a few, but what you wanna do now is you wanna click on create button here. Now, name, just name this whatever you want. So I'll just name this like YouTube tutorial. Now, as I've told you, this is gonna be a landing page which captures people's emails. And then maybe you can give them a free product. You always wanna give them something in return. After all, they're giving you the email. So a free book or some free training works well with this. Now this funnel domain, it's not that important right now. Just leave it on default because you can always change it later. You can just shorten it with URL shortener and that can be done anytime. So for that reason, I'm just gonna leave it as the follow. We're then gonna choose build an audience because we wanna capture emails. This is if you run e-commerce store or something like that. So just choose build an audience. And then we're gonna select the currency here. I'll just go with Canadian dollars, that's mine. Click on save button here. And then we've got it, YouTube tutorial right here. Now I'm just gonna click on it and you can see you've got plenty of these templates and this is for the squeeze page. After that, you're gonna go and create a thank you page. I'll just lead you through it. Now, you can customize every single one of these. If you scroll down, there's like 30 templates. Some of these are more like website style designs and some of them are very simple opt-in pages like this one, for example. You can just scroll down until you find something that is relevant to your niche. You just wanna get something that's relevant to your niche. Don't get like, I don't know, Cyber Monday special deals if you are in the fitness niche, you know? Just make that count. For example, I just like this one. You can always preview this template. So this is how it's gonna look like. And I've told you, you can customize whatever you want. So go back, click on select here, and then it's there. What do you wanna do from here? Well. We just wanna go and we wanna edit this page by clicking on this button here. When you click on it, you are now inside of this systemy editor. And from here, it's actually very simple. So on the left here, just a quick overview, you've got all of your elements, like text elements, media, you can add like different columns, you can build out website, you've got your different forms, inputs, buttons, checkboxes, and a lot of other stuff. Now, because we've used this as a template, everything here that you can see can be edited. So let's start off by removing this like sign up button. I don't need this for this opt-in page. You can click like any one of these, for example, this is the image and there's like trash icon and you can delete this. But if you wanna delete the whole thing, just select the row. As you can see, this is the whole section and you can just delete the whole section. As you can see, the trash icon is gonna appear here. So just delete it if you don't wanna use this one. Click OK. Down there, let's see, I'll just delete this. I don't need this. Just click on it, click on the trash icon for the whole section and it's gone, all right? Now we just need this. Of course, at any time you can choose to see the preview of this page. So you can just click the button, it's here, this button here to preview the page. So this is how it's gonna look like, all right? Now, I don't like because it's too small. So what you can do is you can just go and increase the size of each one of these. So if I click on it, I will get this here where I can just move this down there. You can change the colors, you can change the padding, you know, so for example, it's gonna be like this. Here you can choose if the items are gonna be visible on desktops, on mobiles, and then we're gonna go and we can edit this text box. So. If I name this like YouTube tutorial, I'll just type something like learn how to make money with YouTube videos. Let's just do it like that. And of course, you can make this like heading one 
increase the size of it. Font size is always here. So for example, like this, you can play with line height as well. I like this one. You can change the fonts on the web safe fonts. You've got all of your regular ones, you know, so click on it, change letter spacing. You can do that as well. And of course, here is a brief description. Here is where people type in their emails. It's going to be form input. But if you've just chosen any one of these templates that are like opt in pages, this is going to be all set. You don't have to worry about it. And this is the link which will start the email campaign, which we will make later. And of course, if you want to change the picture, as you can see, you can see a link or you can just upload from your own computer. As I've told you, you get the point everything can be customized. Okay, when you design this in a way you want, it's time to make that email campaign. So we're done. Click on save changes here, go back to your dashboard by clicking here, and then make a thank you page here. So when you click on thank you, you can choose some of these, of course, let's say I want to use this one, I will select it once more, click on the edit page here, then I will just remove this section. I don't need this one. I don't have social media to tie it up this section as well deleted. And for example, this is already a good page. Let me just preview this one. So thanks, you're awesome. It has a spelling mistake, by the way. And I just like to use like move this from the top. Okay, it's gonna be like this, click on save changes. And this is what people are going to see when they give you their emails. Now, time for campaigns. And it's very easy emails, click on campaigns here. And with the free version, you can only have one email campaign running. So I'm just going to delete this one. I'll make it back later. So what do you want to do? You just want to click on create button here, name this campaign. I'll just go with YouTube tutorial once more description. This is just for you email campaign, click on save. And here when you click on it, you go inside and then you create an email subject is going to be your free ebook or whatever you just give out for free sender name. This is going to be your name here. And of course, sender email. Now you've got two options. You've got visual editors and you've got classic editors, but I don't like these because they look spammy. All right. Emails should be only about text. So go over to classic editor, click on save. And then inside you can start writing your email. Don't make it too long. Also, don't make it too spammy. Just make it simple give the link to that free training, free course, free ebook, whatever you've chosen. So for example, I'll just type it like this, like here is your link for a special free ebook. Have a nice day. Okay, of course, it has to be a little bit longer than that. And this is going to be the link here. Just select this link. And here you can see link. All right, click on the link. And this is where you will just paste the link, it's just going to be the thing where you upload it. For example, you can upload the ebook on Google Drive. By the way, if you need free PLR books, just Google for it. There's plenty and then just paste the link from Google Drive, Dropbox, whatever you are using, and people will have the access to it. All right. So what do you want to do? Click on save and publish. And now here you can choose this email will be sent after Let's just say that it's going to be delay like let's just say one minute. Yeah, let's just go after one minute. Click on the activate button here. Now we can exit. We can go back to our funnel. We can go to YouTube tutorial and then you can just click on view funnel here. So view funnel, you can test it out this way. Enter in any email and when I click on get notified, this is the thank you page. And this is what I was telling you about for free. You can use one email campaign and you can sell three sales funnels. All right. When you start making more money, of course, just use these. So that's it for today. I hope that was helpful. And yeah, wish you good luck with your email campaigns. Catch you later.